Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Cancer. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Six of Cups. So this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. And this is a very nostalgic energy. I do see this as someone coming back from your past. This is someone who has some very fond memories of you. I do see someone missing you. This could be someone, um, you know, from your childhood or a childhood sweetheart. Um, I do see this as someone who you may have been very affectionate with before in the past. But for whatever reason, you guys may have um, drifted from each other. And this is them making a return to you and I do see them coming through with genuine heartfelt feelings this person sees you as someone who will always they will always have a soft spot for you this person is very pure um, very genuine feelings towards you is what I'm seeing and um, they have very heartfelt nostalgic feelings towards you so I do see this person coming through here showing you a lot of affection and warmth this person, um, there could even be some past life energy between you guys with this um, Six of Cups energy. This is someone who you have a very strong um, bond. This can be, um, you know, your souls recognizing each other um, or just feeling very intuitively connected with this person. And this is someone who you may, you know, you haven't seen in a long time. And I do see that this could be quite a pleasant surprise when this person returns or um, comes back around to see you. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this cancer okay so the first card we have here is the king of cups so this is water energy cancer pisces scorpio energy next we have the seven of swords in the reverse so this is air energy gemini libra aquarius energy and finally we have the ace of swords air energy again gemini libra aquarius energy Okay, so I do see this person, again, I see a very heartfelt, sincere energy with this person. Um, this person, there could be a sense of you guys not having had, um, you know, the decent amount of closure. You may There may have been some unanswered um, questions around the situation with that Seven of Swords there. But I do see this person coming back with answers. I see this person coming back with truth and clarity. And this person has also matured a lot emotionally. Is what I'm seeing with that King of Cups. This person is really operating from their heart space, and I do see them, um, you know, still feeling um, there is a sense of no matter how long you guys may have been apart, this person still always had a soft spot for you. They may have always held a torch for you. And with that Seven of Swords being in the reverse, this person is going to come very raw. I do see this person exposing themselves, their feelings, their truths, and um, giving you closure. If there is um, some, some questions around a situation with this person that you feel that you never really got the answers there is a sense of you getting those answers now you're getting that closure and it's going to really give you clarity this person is showing up very authentically and i do see them really showing you who they are at the core um this person is going to really show their true colors i do see them wanting to be very open with you and this person still has feelings for you with that king of cups um you know there is a sense of those feelings never went away and they may be in a very nostalgic place right now and wanting to reach out to you and they are still having those heartfelt feelings towards you and i do see them giving a lot of energy and um giving their heart and time to this and they're going to be very vulnerable with you and i do see you getting clarity um when it comes to this person and your situation with them okay so let's clarify these cards cancer
Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Pentacles. So this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So you may also have had some doubts around this connection. This, there's something about this connection that left you feeling like there were some unanswered questions. There was not adequate amounts of closure. And you may, um, for a while, even have questioned why this connection came into your life. What was the meaning or the purpose behind it? You may have really invested a lot into the connection before. And there is just a sense of this connection making you feel a bit wild worried um this person's return um may also leave you having some doubts about them you may still be unsure about the whole thing so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this cancer okay so the first card we have here is the knight of swords so this is air energy gemini libra aquarius energy next we have the seven of cups water energy cancer pisces scorpio energy and finally we have the Six of Swords, Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. Okay, so with that Knight of Swords, that is an energy of someone wanting to save a connection. So this person, um, they are very much in the crux of nostalgia right now. They are feeling all of the feelings from before. And they may even be a bit overwhelmed by them. But this is prompting this person to want to take action towards you. So this person may even want to actually... Um, reconcile they want to restore the connection again so this is more than just them wanting to bring you closure or to give you answers this person actually wants to revive the connection with this knight of swords they are very eager to move things forward again and they may even be at a distance from you they may be traveling towards you with that six of swords energy but this person is very eager to get this connection um back on the flow back you know back up to get it started again and this person may even um present you with a bunch of offers so now with this seven of cups energy that is an energy you know really cautioning you to practice discernment when it comes to this person because there is a sense of this person being very eager to have this connection with you and they may make a lot of promises to you with that seven of cups um but there is something about them um, they may even make some offers that may sound a bit too good to be true is what I'm seeing with that seven of cups energy and you you may even be quite skeptical about this person with that seven of pentacles showing up on your side I do see that you may need to take some time to really assess this person's offer but this person they are um really motivated by nostalgia is what i'm seeing so there could be a lot going on in this person's life currently and they're trying to escape their current reality and they are falling into um they're falling in love with the past they're having they may be romanticizing the past and romanticizing you and wanting to really um get back to that place where you guys were before so this person i do see them making some sort of offers and um they their offers are not very ground they're not really um they're not grounded in reality it's very much based on them romanticizing the past so i am seeing this person they not they may not even be aware that they're doing this but there is something about their current reality that they may be trying to escape and they are very much in um a state of nostalgia and romanticizing things so um there is something about you needing to practice discernment about this person's offer okay so i do see that this person may want things to be very stable with you they may even be romanticizing and thinking about a time where they felt like their life was more peaceful and they may not they may associate that with you and they want to get back to that state right now and i do see that this is prompting them to want to connect reconnect with you okay so cancer i am going to pull out an oracle card for you Okay, so the card says, confidence is your key to success. New moon in Leo. Okay, so I do see that you may have some doubts about this person. With the seven of um, pentacles, you may be a bit unsure about whether you can trust this person's offer. And um, I do see that it would be a good idea to speak up and to let this person know any apprehens apprehensions you may have about what they um, are offering you and their intentions. But And I do see um, a very necessary conversation needs to take place, a very blunt one with this ace of swords energy, where 
um, you can be very honest and um, assertive with this person. I do see that being necessary because this person, they may not be aware of what, what their intentions truly are. They may just be very taken by nostalgia, but there is some things that really do need to be discussed with the Seven of Cups energy. And I do see blunt, open, honest communication being necessary. So I do see that you will have the courage to do that. Um, you, you do see, seem to have some doubts with the Seven of Pentacles and I do see that that initiating that conversation, a very honest, open, blunt conversation will be quite necessary in the situation. So that's what I'm seeing for you, Cancer. I hope that you have a really, really good day, Cancer. Bye, Cancer.